Hello, dear. Well, hello, angelfish. What can I do for a curious human like yourself? I want to make a deal. How delicious. I'm intrigued. What kind of deal do you have in mind? So there's this catfish I would love to have. To cook. Mm -hmm. You want to have your catfish and eat it too, huh? Of course, we must discuss the subject of payment. You can't get something so rare for nothing, you know. Bring me one of the most unique flowers in the village. A white and red hydrangea. And if you do that, I'll get you your catfish. Do we have a deal? Yes. Marvelous, dearie. Oh, someone's on a roll. <laughs> oh, the valley is coming along nicely. Thank you. She's so nice. I don't know why everyone's always talking about how mean she is. Blue hydrangea. Red and white? She's still over there. There she is. Oh, don't you- God dang it! Oh, wait, she's still here. Where? Oh, you're- You purposely made me think you left. Oh, My flower. You are. Aren't you a good little minnow? Now as agreed, here's the extremely rare fish you wanted. I hope it's all you wished for. Why are you still here? Shoot! Need anything from the market? Just come see me! Donald's mad again. Mickey went to sleep. I knew he was gonna go to sleep. It seems like he sleeps- can I leave? Hello? He seems like he sleeps from like midnight until like 4 a.m. Mr. McDuck asked me to tell Donald to go visit him. My map is broken. Okay. What is happening? Oh god, everything's broken. How you doing, Deadly? Everything's broken! Oh no! Let's hope it uh, saved rather recently. I just wanted to talk to Donald because Mr. McDuck told us to tell Donald to visit for inventory. So I guess we'll see. I didn't know if that was something I actually had to do or, um, or if it's uh, just like an offhand thing. Miss Kizzy, I am Kizzy. Where? Where is Donald Duck? Oh, uh, okay, it's saved. So I just... Donald's at his house. He's ranting and raving about his house again. What is happening? 
Let's go see your house. We're at his house. Here we are. We saw his house. Now what? Oh, I. Oh no, it's this again. Donald. Okay, well, I don't want to see your house. Okay, so I don't have to tell him anything is what I just learned. Why does he walk like that? What a weird little walk he has. No, oh, Miss. Oh, a chest. Hello, Mr. McDuck. Oh, greetings, neighbor. Brilliant. So what was her fair price for this catfish? She asked me to get her one of the rarest flowers in the village. Ah. As I expected. Her deals are consumer traps. One of the rarest flowers in the village in exchange for a common fish usually caught in any village waters. This is outrageous. It's time to expose that crook for what she is. I'm going to give her a piece of my mind. Thank okay. you kindly. Oh, I don't usually wear hoops, but maybe. Oh. Okay, sure. I'm more of a, a diamond stud kind of person. Daffy or Donald, which is the better duck? Oh, I mean, there's so much flashy gold going on over here. Um, Daffy or Donald? They both have bad tempers. So I don't know. They're both very ornery. Oh, that's cute. Okay, I look adorable. Our, I guess we're going to see Ursula, maybe. Where's Ursula? She's in the swamp. Don't leave! Gosh dang it, every time! You, I have proof of your fishy business practices and they stink. What's the matter, Scroogey? Afraid of a little competition? Never. And trust me, I'll find a way to put an end to your dastardly dealings. You can't, you can count on it. But how? When you'll be so busy searching for these. Oh. Oh. <gasps> Shiny, isn't it? Look closely. What's happening? It's just washed up on shore. I suppose it must come from a vast treasure of some sort, don't you? Curse me kilts! A gold coin! One lonely gold coin. And where there's one, there's usually many more! Never mind what I came here for. I need to go. Ha ha ha. So predictable. Oh. So so we're just done now? All that after all that? Hey, I've got a job for you. Kizzy, never mind that dreadful business with Ursula. We have a far more pressing matter Aye. now. <laughs> There's treasure in the village, and we cannot let it be found by anyone but us. I'll research what the treasure might be and get in touch as soon as well, I know I'll more. A wee bit of conversation. Okay. Well. Since we're here. Let's take a look around.
Bruce rearranging a couple of things for Scrooge McDuck's, uh... For his, um... Quest. And it, it helps make things look nicer, which is fine. Because everything... It's not that the things in the... In the places are, are strangely placed. It's more that sometimes you walk around and things are just... Crowded. Scrooge McDuck has a quest available. I have a lot of a lot of quests that have to be unlocked. Scrooge? Oh, he's running away. They always want to run away right when I have to talk to them. Good day to you. Greetings. Well, the glade is certainly in good hands with you, Kizzy. I haven't seen it looking so nice in ages. You keep up the good work and you'll make a village of your own in well no time. Done. Oh, greetings, neighbor. Just who I wanted to see. Do you remember this gold coin Ursula gave me? The one I was sure belonged to a larger treasure? Well, I'm certain of it now, and that treasure's waiting for us to find it. But I can't unmanage the shop and search for treasure, so I'll need your help. Of course I'll help you. Splendid. Now take the coin. Maybe with your magic you can make sense out of it. Thank you kindly. Hmm. Okay. Greetings, neighbor. Tear me, Tartan. What just happened? What did you do to my coin, Kizzy? The coin turned into a memory. Oh, if they all turn into this, I'll lose money on this venture. But never mind that for now. If it's a memory, then you have to follow what it shows. Find where it's pointing you to, and you'll find the treasure. Goodbye now. Toodaloo. Well, one area was Merlin's, uh... Merlin's library. Excuse me, Merlin. Gotta go into your house for a second. Okay. <laughs> the other one was the Glade of Trust. figured out my um I have to level up his friendship. Let's uh well let's go do the other thing. What what level friendship am I at with Merlin seven? I can I can have him follow me for a second, actually. Oh let's hang out. Hello Thank you. You're very kind.
We're doing great. Well, I'm, I passed the banana tree. Hey, Wally, I'm not Eva. He's so cute. Merlin? Okay. He scared me. Nice. can make candy it says he wants candy let's see let's try something let's experiment for a second what if I did like an apple And some sugar cane, wherever that is. Okay, well, you know. What about a blueberry and some sugar cane? Fruit salad! And I'm guessing if I did an apple... Sugar cane and weed, it would be a pie. Oh, it's crackers. How do you make a pie? Okay, well, I tried. Come on, Merlin. I probably should have emptied my inventory. It's fine. Alright. not to take it off. Howdy! Nice. So long! What a day. What a day I'm indeed. How much does this cost? Good day, dear. Wally's garden only a thousand? Nice. I don't feel like anything's changed. He looks exactly the same. Oh, greetings, neighbor. Woo! <laughs> It still looks exactly the same. Am I being punked by Good Scrooge day, McDuck? Oh, 
Greetings, neighbor. <laughs> well, I just spent all of my money on, on Wally's garden. So... Time to make some money. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna walk away now. Oh, it looks clean now. Good. Hopefully Wally appreciates it. How far, how far away are we from, from Merlin uh, being level 8? And after I've worked so hard to make Merlin's house look nice, too. Oh, Daisy. Upgrade Wally's garden. I'm almost done upgrading Wally's garden, apparently. Oh, we're so close to upgrading Merlin. Okay. Hopefully this quest is what I want it to be. Oh, hello. Kizzy, I was just thinking of you and how you were sure to appear momentarily. Why were you thinking mm. about me? Do you, re do you recall when I enchanted your watering can to remove mushrooms? Yes, I do. That's exactly what I wanted. Thank you very much. I may have found a way to make that enchantment permanent. Perfect. It's all to do with the purified night shards we discovered. Once you gather a few ingredients, I'll show you. We will need mushrooms, emeralds, and purified night shards. Thank you. You're very kind. Emeralds, huh? Mushrooms, emeralds, and purified night shards. Okay. We can definitely make that happen. So, once my watering can is upgraded, we'll be able to go to that other part of the, the Glade of Trust so I could find the last treasure piece. Now Goofy's here. Good to see ya. Oops. Sell. Great. Mm -hmm. Good boy. Great. We need three purified night shards and 20 mushrooms. I probably don't have that many mushrooms. I think I've been using them a lot to cook. Alright, 
20 mushrooms. I have one mushroom. I have one mushroom. Okay. Well, right. hello. Let's send Merlin away. I tip my hat to you. Treasure hunt and rebuild the forest of valor. All right, so let's collect the mushrooms out of the glade that we can get right now. And then we're going to go do that other quest. The one on the raft. Any mushrooms? Oh, art's just there. I did all the other things for nothing. I guess not for nothing. I would have had to do it anyway, but, you know. And there's no mushrooms around. that's not going to be a problem. But let's go talk to Scrooge. Or, you know, instead of doing Scrooge, uh, let's just go do that other thing. Oh, Wally. The blueberries away. I'll put the raspberries there for now. Put the rocks away. And then we'll go do the raft. See what we can find. Okay. Oh, the bunny rabbits. They want so much from me. Figure out where- oh, the Lonely Island. Oh dear. I'm just gonna collect some stuff right now. Before we talk to Ariel. Oh, I've been stuck here alone for so long. I thought I'd never see anyone again. Can you help me, please? I'll help you. What happened? Oh. I was living in a beautiful valley, and it was the most wonderful place. Until something called the forgetting happened. <gasps> Night thorns started growing in the village, and lots of people lost their memories. It was awful. Mm. But then all of a sudden, I was here, as if by magic. Mm -hmm. I haven't seen anyone in such a long time. I tried to go back to the valley, but I can't find my way home. I come from that valley. I'll help you. <laughs> oh, thank you. I've been trying to get home. But no matter which way I swim, I end up right back on the island. It must be some kind of magic. I think it's an enchantment. If I could just sense the valley, then I'd know which way to swim. Oh. Mer people can always find their way home, but it doesn't feel like the valley is my home anymore. 
Maybe if I made a place just for you in the valley, somewhere that feels like home, then you could sense it. That's perfect. Could it be in the water just off the beach? Then I know I'll be able to swim home. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I almost forgot to introduce myself. I'm Ariel, and you? You seem familiar. Have we met before? I think we have, but that was a long time ago. I'm Kizzy, the ruler of Dreamlight Valley. Or at least, I used to be. You are! Oh, you're so grown up now. I can't believe you're back and you're helping me. I'm happy to help. I'll get that home ready for you as soon as I can. Let's talk again soon, okay? What am I taking a picture of? Okay. Cool. Tinkering parts, mint chocolate, and yellow nesturium. Any tinkering parts, and I don't want to make any. Okay, let's go see. Talk to Ariel. Is she here? Yeah. See how much it costs to build this. Good day to you. Five thousand. Okay. Oh. How about a wee bit of conversation? Is she all the way out here? I'm so happy to be back. I can't wait to see Eric. Where is he? Uh, I have no idea. You haven't seen him? Oh no, that can't be good. I gotta ask everyone if they know where he went. Thanks for your help, Kizzy. Oh, look at that. Tell me about your hobbies. I love to sing, and Sebastian says I'm pretty good at it. Do you like to sing? Yes. That's fantastic. Tell me, what's your favorite kind of song? Um, rock anthems. Oh, I don't think I've heard it. I've ever heard of those. They must be songs that rockfish sing. <laughs> Thank you. I'm 
I'm so happy you're here. <laughs> Let's. All right. I need five thousand dollars. I also need emeralds, so let's go up. Oh dear. Slightly terrifying, but okay. Oh good, Scrooge is here. We can talk to him about the treasure. How about a wee bit of conversation? Good day to you. Great Scott. I couldn't have done it without you. Looks like the memory wasn't pointing us to the treasure, but to pieces of some kind of map. Oh, I I'm sure I can put them together. Let me work on it and I'll be back at you. I'm dead, Ward. Another piece of daisy. Cute. No emeralds this time. 